Today, we're going to talk about how team works. None of this, no team. I made a little plan here. Our team work. To make this team the team X, we will need team manager. Why? Because the guy is going to deal with different sponsors, try to convince them he's going to get this rider, this rider, and this rider. And what is good for the company to spend money in the team. Because here we get media. That's why I put media crew here. here. Exposure and testing for his product and obviously result if one of these riders is going to make into the podium. Why money? You need to pay UCI. You need to pay mechanics for those riders. They need to have mechanics. Mechanics don't work for free. Then we go around the world. That's where I put here logistic, travels and hotel because it works for riders and mechanics and as well for some people we have extra cash, we get a physio, a masseuse, everything they need to have the riders to compete at the highest level. Beside that, we need trucks. To bring the trucks to the events, you need gasoline, you need to pay the toll road. Tents, you need to brand the tents with the sponsor you're going to have on board on the team. That's why you need money from the sponsors. Of course, the sponsors will be some of them on the jersey because it's all about the scales of the money people are going to put in the team to be able to be on the jersey the other one will be just listed on the team or on the tents or on the team vehicles after that talking about the travel travel sometimes uh, the mechanics we travel with a truck driver the truck driver we bring all over europe the truck set up the truck we some of the athletes sometimes because i really do think that riders should help the mechanics because that's a teamwork and the other one we take the, the the plane or the train why because as an athlete you need to recover and um, don't spend your energy uh, sitting in a truck for 15 hours for the people who have a lower budget no choice you get in a truck and you shut up beside that why the media crew is important because he's a guy who's going to film the full team from setting up the truck to training waking up early going to bed really late for edit all those videos for what for social media and maybe for one or two videos during the week then he's going to represent everything everything about racing teamwork and putting the product from all the sponsors who spend the money into that team. I think uh, that's basically everything you need to make either a team A, or want to be a team A, but you don't have all the cash, then you're going to obviously face some problem, then you need to cut down maybe, uh, instead of having three mechanics, getting one, no physio, not flying with a plane or at least not in business class and uh, that's how it's done but how much does it cost to run a team and why like i say running a team depends how many riders and how many people are in the team obviously it's a lot different when you have three people in a team or if you have 15 because everyone needs to eat, everyone needs to sleep, and everyone is going to travel. And everyone is going to uh, need a salary. Because without salary, you're not paying your food. And you need uh, those little money, which uh, we call money, to go into uh, the bar and have a good time uh, with your mate, uh, having a beer and a chat during the day. Why? Team are the best and the most beautiful image you can get. If you're making products, we want to be known for how strong they are, how beautiful they are, uh, how strong as uh, everything. Those people are going to do the job, from the team manager to the rider, 
to the mechanic, to the social media people, to the media crew, uh, because they're going to put your products into the big picture. And especially if your team is the best team of the year, for you is ching ching, it's like playing lottery. That's why sometimes you start with a small team and you have great products and uh, when your sales are picking up, maybe you invest in a bigger team. It works all like this in Formula One or soccer players or whatever it is, teams or soccer, football or whatever it is. Team manager, what is a tough? What is a job? What is, uh, what is his, uh, what he have to do? That guy is going to go to meet all the sponsors to try to sell the team. He have a clear idea of how much cost the team to be run the full year of racing. The riders. Riders have offer from different teams. They're going to go in your team for two reasons. Because they love the team or they love the sponsor. It's been represented into the team or because they want money. It's easy. Why did I put UCI? You need to pay placement for your truck, the license for the team, and let me tell you, it's not cheap. But it is the Union Cycling of International, and those guys run the World Cup, and that's the way it works, and for many, many years. Mechanics! If you have three riders, you cannot have one mechanic. If not, this guy is going to shut himself after maybe one or two races because when everything is going perfect, according to plan, no problem. When it starts to rain and you still have flat tires and you break some parts, that guy is going to work until four o'clock in the morning. Then, uh, yeah, you need mechanics. And obviously, they're getting paid and is going to be in charge of all the equipment of all the riders in the team. Physio or masseuse, if you have extra money, definitely, definitely a great investment for the athletes because it's tough to race all around the world. And obviously you're going to crash and you need to have someone to look over your body as much as a guy who look all over your bike. Logistic. Travel the hotels. This is the people we never see, but the people who work as hard as everyone else. They're looking for the best deal for the planes. They're looking for the best hotel. They're looking for apartments to make sure that you can cook and eat. Uh, what doesn't matter what time it is. And this uh, we can see more and more than people use a lot more the, the apartments because uh, you have to go your grocery, you buy all the food you need, and it's no time, it will be always food on the table. Especially when a team is on the budget, definitely the way to go. Hotel, you're going to eat at the hotel, but after 9 or 10 o'clock, you cannot eat anymore. What about that mechanic who work until 3 o'clock in the morning? What is he going to do? Eat a sandwich? No, you don't leave in sandwiches. You need to sleep and eat good as much as everyone else in the team. Everyone have his part here. And everyone is important. Everyone. Everyone. No one is uh, any better than someone else. This is a, a team. That's where you get wins. What did I talk today about the tents? And I think the, sh the rider should help mechanics and team manager to set up tents. Why? Because it's a team spirit. That's where you make the foundation of your house. That's how you build the team. That's how you connect to your mechanic. That's why you make friends. That's why you show your respect for the team and work with them. It's not because you're an athlete, you're not going to help. And this means a lot into a team. It means a lot to the team manager, it means a lot to your mechanic. It means a lot to you because you show that you guys work hard for me in the weekend to be able to win. I will work for you today. Then we can finish early and we can have a nice dinner all together. That's team spirit. And this is for one goal. To have those riders to do as less as possible. Because at the end of the day, the riders, they need to get focused on what they do to be able to perform right. They need to ride to practice, 
go to the room, take a shower, legs up, chill, watch video about the track. That is how it's done. Team spirit one more time. Riders training, training done, sign autograph, social media videos. To the room, legs up, chill, eat, kill it next day. Shortly, it's how a team work. That's how you run the team. Not rocking silence here, but I broke it down to you to understand a little bit more what is the job of everyone, but everyone connects. There's no missing piece. If you take one part of this drawing here, it's a lot harder. If you take one mechanic out, a lot harder. If you don't have the best food, a lot harder. If you don't have the cash from the sponsors, who trust in your team, trust in the future of your riders and about everything you need to make work and not with the media crew, it's going to be a big trouble. Take the media crew out. What are you going to do with the photos and videos? That's how it's done. I've been there, I've been the rider, I've been the team manager with CG Racing Brigade, and it was, uh, it was hard. I was just happy I got Kevin as well. Head mechanic who was running the team. I think for me, that kid at the time, because he was a kid, he was the manager of the full team. But uh, let me tell you, it's not easy to run a team. That's why big up to all the team manager, run the show to make sure the riders can do their job. Thank you very much, lads. This is my vision and I hope you like it and share it.